What's good, everybody? Quay Max, aka Quay, aka the singer, the waning jazz, the failed I'm Dante, the broke Prince Charming, the skinny Tyro Madness, and the skinny Shaw God, aka you already know the rest. Your favorite fallopian tuber. All right. Today, we'll be looking at SML movie. Jeffy almost drowns. Hopefully, uh, that changes to Jeffy actually drowns because we know I want to see that. All right. But <laughs> well, hopefully, you guys enjoy. If you do, you already know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. Sub to me. If not, you're racist. I don't make the rules up. It's just go. That's just how it goes around here. Okay. And uh, shit, let's get started. Oh, I finally get a day to just sit back, relax, and not go anywhere. That's what I tried Come on, to do. Marvin, we're all going to the <laughs> beach. What? The beach? Yes, the beach. It'll be fun. Yeah, gay, I'm a swimming whale poop. I don't want to go to the beach. It's hot and sandy. I don't like it. But Marvin, it's a beautiful. Why are you not, bro? Bro, the bro, the beach is the perfect place to go. There ain't nothing but beaches. You know what I'm saying? You go to the you go to the beach. What do you see at the beach? A bunch of naked men. Some of them with six packs, bruh. Nigga, I, nigga, somebody asked me to go to the beach. I'm going there expeditiously. Need that. Beautiful need that. day out. We need to be outside. No, I don't want to go. And day, I'm also going to tan my beach balls. Well, I'm not going. You guys go. I'm going to stay here. No, we're all going, Marvin. Your biggest stupid beach. Very mature. Come on. <sighs> Marvin, isn't the beach so nice? No, I hate it. It's hot. I want to go home. Marvin, stop whining. Just try to relax. Hey, Dan, can you help me build a sandcastle? No, I don't want to play in the sand. I don't want to get all sandy. Marvin, yeah. go build a, a sandcastle with Jeffy. I don't want to. Well, can I go play in your water? No, Jeffy, you might drown. Marvin, let him have some fun. Yes, Jeffy, you can go swimming. Just don't go out too far. Yay! You can go ahead, go, Jeffy. Go ahead, swim. Go ahead, swim in the ocean. Just go as far as you can and as deep as you can in the ocean, bro. Definitely. We go home yet? No, Marvin, we just got here. Ugh, I'll just lay on the towel. Water? Ah! Scary water? Ah! Get in that water. There we go. There we go. See, Marvin, isn't this relaxing? Yeah, I guess it is. Jeffy! Marvin, Jeffy's drowning! I don't, hear, I don't know what to do. I don't hear nothing. I don't know what to do. Go help! Uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Huh? Someone needs help? <laughs> I got you, bro. Don't worry, I got you. Don't let I'm that nigga let drown. Oh my god! Thank you for saving him! We're not out of the woods yet. <sighs> breathe, damn it, breathe! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you shaved. Man, you should have let that little nigga drown, bro. Nothing of value would have been lost if he if he drowned. No cap. I ain't I ain't even gonna lie to you, bro. If he would have drowned, cool. That's hey, that's fine with me. That's that's less of a headache right there. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm with it. You ain't have to come in and Captain Captain save a Jeffy. Like, come on, bro. My life, mister. Oh, thank you for saving our son. Yeah, it's what I do. Wait, Brad? What, Rose? I haven't seen you in forever. What, you know each other? Yeah, he's one of my exes, Marvin. You didn't tell me about God me. damn, how many, how many, how many, how many exes you got? First, it was the, 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 the black boxer, Super D, Brad. Like, 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 you really been passed around like a, like a, like a hacky sack. What the? You don't even look that. You don't even look that good. You getting passed around like a like a like a blunt. What the? God. Brad. Yeah, he was not important enough to come up. Hey, what's up, man? My name's Brad with a big D at the end. Cause when a girl goes on a date with me, that's what she gets at the end. A big D. Well, it was nice meeting you, Brad. Thanks for saving our son. Let's go. No, Marvin. Wait. We should do something nice. We should invite him to dinner. We don't have to do anything nice for him. He's a lifeguard. He's supposed Facts. to save people. That's but what he's supposed to do. I was just laying on the beach, working on my perfect tan, and I saw that kid needed help, so I just did what any good person would do. Well, that's nice. That's really nice, Brad. So we're gonna leave now. No, Marvin. We have to thank him. We don't have to thank you him. You don't gotta thank Brad, him nothing. Come to dinner tonight. Okay. Okay, but I'm pescatarian, so I only eat fish. But you'd know that, wouldn't you, Rose? <laughs> he likes salmon. Oh, okay, well, that's real nice. All right, well, we're going to leave. Right, come on, Jeffy. Man, Jeffy, I'm so I don't care, bro. They don't got nothing. Listen, we don't need to, to bring him home for what, bro? He did what he was supposed to do, bro. He did what he was supposed to do. So so if my house catch on fire, the firefighter comes and, and douses the, the flames with, with water, oh, thank you. Hey, you want to come over to dinner tonight? No, he did what he's supposed to do. That ain't none of my business. Ain't that right, Zach? See, Zach. Nope, nigga, alert, Zach's alert. Spitting. And shout out to all the broke niggas in here, man. I'm one of them. 
so glad you're okay. I can't believe you invited your ex to dinner. <laughs> wow, thanks for caring, Daddy. Marvin, he saved Jeffy's life. Who cares? Again, thanks for caring, Daddy. Well, you didn't save him, Marvin. I would have if I would have had a swimming suit on. I, I had this outfit on. Your only outfit? Yeah, and to be fair, Daddy, you did wear a tie to the beach. I didn't want to go to the beach. You literally dragged me there. Marvin, we're going to thank him and cook him a nice dinner. I'm not cooking him dinner. I'm not doing anything for that weirdo. Well, fine. Chef Pee Pee will do it then. Chef Pee Pee? Yes, Chef Pee Pee. I already paid. Him. You paid Chef Pee Pee to cook dinner for him? Yes, Marvin. We don't have much, but we can thank him over a nice dinner. Why do we have to thank him? I'm sure you thanked him enough when y'all dated. Facts. I didn't even meet the guy anyway. I was in California at the Santa Monica That's not enough. I need more, Daddy. Facts. I don't know what it. I don't know what this is about. I don't know what they're talking about. But that's facts, though. Like, 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 like. I'm pretty sure you already thanked him enough when y'all was together. When you was on your knees, tying your, putting your ponytail back. What we need to thank him for? He do. He did what he's supposed to do. And then that's your ex too. Why you want your ex to come back over here? For what? Sound like you. If, it sound like you want to get back together with him. And if that's the case, y'all can both go. And we hooked up a couple of times. Jeez, a couple times. I was young, Marvin. It didn't mean anything. <laughs> if it didn't mean anything, then why did why is saving Jeffy meaning something to you? Like, don't talk to the guy. Like, I don't like him. Uh, you don't have to like him, Marvin, but we do have to thank him over a nice dinner. Why does it have to be a dinner? Why can't we write him a letter? Yeah. You want to write him a letter? Yeah, I'll write him two letters. F you. Marvin! <laughs> oh, that's a good one, Daddy. Give me four fingers. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. that was smooth. Go downstairs w. and help Chef Pee Pee cook the dinner. Oh, I'll help, all right. Oh, I'll, I'll do stuff to the food. Mm -hmm. uh, Mm -mm, this looks delicious. Yeah, that's really hey, good. Chef PB, my wife said you're cooking dinner. Oh, yeah, I just got done. Wait, this looks amazing. Yeah, really I know, thank you. What are you doing? What? Is it not supposed to look good? No, my no. wife's inviting her ex boyfriend over for dinner. Oh, with her ex? Oh, why don't you just break up with her? Well, her ex kind of saved Jeffy's life. He was drowning, and she wants to make it up to him by bringing him over for dinner. Oh, well, that makes sense. Well, I thought you sucked at cooking. I thought you made disgusting food. Well, not when I'm getting paid. And your wife paid me $20, so I went all out. Well, for 20 bucks? I'll pay you 20 extra more dollars to spit in the food. Like, I want you to do gross things to it. Like, when, when he eats his food, I want him to throw up. Like, when he sees his food, I want him to never want to come back ever again. That's how gross I want to be. Bro, you, know, you want me to go all out. Yeah, I want you to Bats, ruin I want you to go all the way in, bro. I want you to go all the way. I want you to piss in the food. I want you to doodle -doo on the food. I want you to throw up on the food. I want you to, to leave the house, catch coronavirus, catch every single STD that's out there, every single disease, come back, rub your genitals right on the food. I want you to rub, you rub your hairy, long, wrinkly balls all over the food. And matter of fact, it would be even better if you leave testy hairs on there. Facts. This food. Okay, let's start Facts. with this. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Oh, this ooh, is... Let's rub it all over the toilet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes sir. sir. Yeah. All right, Marvin. I'm going to clean the toilet with the salmon. Do it, do it, do it. <laughs> oh, that's yep. so gross. I know, I yep. know. Oh, that's disgusting. Ooh, ooh, watch this. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> Let's put the shrimp in this litter box. Oh, that's disgusting. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, that was nice and disgusting. Isn't this the most diabolical, disgusting, horrible meal you've ever yeah. seen? Yeah. Oh, it makes me want to throw up. Oh, yeah. That guy's definitely not going to want your wife after he eats this. Oh, yeah, definitely not. He's going to take one bite. He's going to run away and never talk to her again. Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay, I'm going to go tell my wife that dinner is ready. So uh, just make something normal for me and my wife, okay? Okay. Are you going to pay me for that, too? No. <sighs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, baby, dinner is ready. Wow, Marvin, you seem to be in a good mood. Yeah, I realized I was being stupid, getting Great mad mood. that your ex-boyfriend's coming over for dinner. Well, I'm glad you've matured, Marvin. Yeah. <laughs> something something that? like that. That's probably Brad. Uh, let's answer the door. Okay. Hello? Hi, Brad. What's up? Thank you so much for coming to dinner. Thanks for not wearing a shirt. Oh, I don't believe in shirts. I just feel like they constrict me, and I gotta be free, you know? What? He's a free spirit. You know? Did you have to bring a surfboard to dinner? Oh, yeah, you never... He actually kind of spitting. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, he actually kind of spitting. Shirts are, like, clothes are kind of constricting. If I could, and if it was legal, i walk out the I walk out the house naked. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like... I feel like the uh, the panties that I have on right now are, are very restrictive right now. You know what I'm saying? I want to be free. I want to be loose. You know what I'm saying? So if, if if we can, if we as men can take our shirts off in public, I don't see why we why we can't be butt naked. That's just me though. You know when a That's gnarly wave's gonna rip by, and also it's basically a part of my body. Like literally, help! It's fused with my hand. Help! Well, come inside. That's what she said to me. <laughs> Just shut up and come inside. So, like I mentioned at the front door, this surfboard is stuck to my hand, so please help me. Mm-mm-mm, 
doesn't this food look good, Bradley? Uh, my name's actually Brad, with a big D at the end, because when I take girls on dates... I know, you already explained it. Just look at the food. Aw, Chef Pee Pee made me a salad. So, Brad, what do you do for a living? Bro, I live for a living. You don't have a job? <laughs> no. Wow, baby, Thanks. it sounds like you dated a total bomb. Well, actually, Marvin, Brad's family is very wealthy. Yeah, have you heard of the Shell gas stations? Yeah. Yeah, well, my family invented those. Check the necklace. Your family invented the Shell gas station? Yeah, so I'm loaded like a big potato. <laughs> so all I do all day is just surf, look at beautiful chicks, and beg people to help me with this surfboard that's stuck to my hand. Please help me, someone. Well, I think it's time for us to eat because I'm as hungry as a shark. You know, I got bit by a shark one time. Really? Yeah. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't ask. I didn't ask if you got bit by, I don't care if you got bit by a, 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 a big black woman. I didn't ask. Aquarium petting zoo. I punched him right in the nose, because that's how you deal with sharks, in case you didn't know. You're so brave. Yeah, I kept all its teeth on a necklace back home. I got it at the gift shop. I can give you one if you want, but I only give it to people I really care about. Well, I think we should focus on eating. Let's They're dig in. They're disrespecting him yeah, right in front of me. Unfortunately, them. I am left-handed, and like I said, I have this surfboard stuck to my hand, so please, dear God, someone help me. Well, you can just, like, you know, eat with your face like a little piggy, like a little dirty pig boy, like a little, like a little stinky pig boy. <laughs> Yeah, I, I guess I'll, I guess I'll do that. How is it, Brad? Bradley? Br 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 yes, Br sir. Marvin is How's it taste, Brad? Marvin's sandwich. Is it gross? I'm gonna get my mouth and mouth. No, 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 you did no. not enough when y'all date. Fast. He, it's okay. He just, he just had a mouthful. Marvin, call the doctor. He's fine. Yeah, he good. Brad? Brad? Yeah, he good. He just taking a little nap. He, he got a little sleepy after eating. He good. He good, he just taking a little nap, he all right. Bradley? Marvin, do something! Bradifer? Oh no, baby, I think he's dead. Oh no! Nah. No, 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 calm down, just, just hold on, like, hold on, I'm gonna call a doctor and let me talk to Chef Bibi. Chef Bibi, Chef Bibi! Hold on, hold on, let me guess, Marvin. <laughs> he hated it. No, 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 he had a stomach ache and pooped everywhere. No, he threw up and pooped. Nope. No, 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 he ran out of the house crying like a little baby. <laughs> no, he's dead. What? Take we killed him. No, we didn't kill him. No, we just made the food dirty. <laughs> Whatever we did, poisoned him, and now he's dead, and we're gonna go to jail. No, we're not going to jail. I'm not going to jail for your relationship issues. My booty's too tight for that. Oh, my, my, my wife wants me Facts. to call a doctor. What do we do? Look, look, look. I'm gonna dress up like a doctor, and I'm gonna just tell her that everything's fine. He's just sleeping or something like that, and then we're gonna bury the body. Oh, I like that idea. That's a really smart idea. I love okay. that. Yeah, yeah. I'm very smart. I know oh, what I'm doing. Oh, okay, get a doctor outfit. Okay. So doctor Pee Pee. <laughs> Yeah, he should be here any moment. Hey, 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 uh, did somebody call a doctor? Yes, doctor, he choked and I think he's dead. Oh, no, he can't be dead. No, 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 not from eating all this good food. He's probably just sleeping with his eyes open. Yeah, yeah. he's sleeping. Crazy kid. Okay. Let me check his pulse. Oh, no, <gasps> Marvin, he's dead. He doesn't have a pulse. I know that, just lie to her. Is he dead? He's not dead. He's just sleeping with his eyes open. Yeah. yeah. Some people fall asleep after eating good food. He's just in a, a food coma. That's what they call it. Oh, I think I've heard of those before. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Food coma. Yeah, yeah. So, doctor, what would you suggest we do with the sleeping body? Uh, oh, we should drag the sleeping body to bed. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, so we're going to take the body and put no, it we got We putting that sleepy body six feet deep underground, bro. Nah, that's what, that's what I would do. In bed, you just finish your salad, baby. Okay. Oh, come on, doctor. Hurry, hurry, hurry. All right, Muffin, let's get rid of this body. Muffin? Oh, yeah, you know I love that mustache, baby. What? No, no, no. I gotta fight these urges. We gotta focus on the body. <laughs> what? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Should I pee pee on the DL? Welcome to the club. I gotta run that back. Oh, yeah, you know I love that mustache, baby. No, 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 I gotta fight these urges. We gotta focus on the body. Yeah, the body first. So how we get rid of the body? You said we were gonna bury it. No, we can't bury it. The police dog can sniff out the body and, and, and dig up the body and we'll get caught. Oh, okay, we, we gotta think of another way to get rid of the body. Uh, have you seen Breaking Bad? Yeah, I've seen Breaking Bad. Yeah, they put the body in the bathtub and then they pour the acid over it so it eats up the body. Oh, that's genius. Yeah, there, there'll be no proof and there'll be no evidence and then the cops we'll, can't find them. We'll burn oh, yeah, the body. Well, let's do that, let's do that. Get the acid. Okay, I'll get the acid. You take the body in the bathtub. Okay. All right, I got the acid. Body decomposing acid? Where'd you even buy this? 
They sell it at Home Depot in the I don't want to get caught section. <laughs> you actually bought it? Well, I use cash. There's no trace. Okay, good, good. No trace. I like that. All right, so I'm going to put the body in the bathtub, and you're going to pour the ass on it, all right? Okay. All right, let's do that. Ooh, who's that? I don't know. Let's answer it. Okay. Hello? Hey. Oh, no. The cops. Why did they hit, bro? Out about Brad's body. Ah! Hey. What was that? What was what? That that thing you just did. Uh, oh, that was our secret handshake. Yeah, handshake. You guys didn't touch hands. Y usually handshakes have hand touching at least. Oh, oh no, no, we don't do that. That's it's that, germs. It's that, germs. That, yeah, yeah, you know, you know. Yeah, we don't do that. That's germs. But instead of instead of using our hands, we we just uh do it by our glizzies. The pandemic's going on. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So what are you doing here? Well, I'm looking for a guy named Brad. I don't know a guy no, named Brad. I don't know no, Brad. No, I don't know Never Brad. Never had a Brad in my life. Do you know Brad? No, I don't know Brad. No, I don't know Brad either. I, I, I know it's just a chef. I know a Chad, I think. Mm -hmm. No Brad. You know, you two are the definition of suspicious. Suspicious. <laughs> no, we're gonna find these <laughs> what, what? What was that? No, 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 no nothing, nothing. No, we don't know a Brad. You should. No, uh, you should yeah, you should ask the neighbors if they've seen Brad. Mm -hmm. well, what, like, 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 what, what, what's up with man? You might. It's 2021, man. You might as well jump out that closet, man. Go ahead, kiss him. French kiss him. Australian kiss him. Uh, UK kiss him. Whatever. Italian kiss him. Whatever nationality. Go ahead, do that. Go ahead, do that. You know what I'm saying? I do it all the time with my homies. Facts. It's 2021. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead. I'm, I am I'm support, I support it. Well, I did, and they said they saw Brad come here earlier today. They did. Okay, stop, stop doing that. I don't like that. Well, look, we have not seen Brad, and and it's like, it's like it hasn't been seventy-two hours, has it? So he can't, he can't have a missing person report. Yeah. Yeah, but his family's rich, and they put a tracker in his surfboard, and it says that he's in here. Nah. <sighs> okay, fine. He's here. He's sleeping in the bathtub. What are you doing? Oh, look, I know what I'm doing. Yeah, he's in the bathtub. But why is he in your bathtub? He just wanted to take a nap, so he just wanted to chill. So, so just chill, homie. What? Uh, okay, I'm gonna. Nah, he got the dirty. House. Oh no, hold on, hold on. Okay. So uh, when the cop comes in the house. Hit him over the head with a rolling pin. All right, gotcha. Excuse me? <laughs> Did you just fart? Wait, no, no. I heard what you just said. Well, what did I say? You told him to hit me in the head with a rolling pin. Nah. No, I didn't. Oh, see, that's just a, a figure of speech. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. In my house, uh, hit him in the head with a rolling pin means offer him a drink. Yeah, yeah. Are you thirsty? Yeah. What kind of uh, flavor rolling pin would you like? Uh, yeah, yeah. What rolling? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't know why the cop thought that he actually meant hit him over the head with a with a rolling pin. He's he obviously told him to get him some drink. So if a police officer come to my house and I tell the police officer, come in, give me some head, all right? I'm not really, when I say come and give me some head, I'm not, I'm not, I don't really mean come and give me some head. I'm I'm saying come and get some dinner. You know what I'm saying? You got you just have to understand that everything is a literal. Every, you know, sometimes it's, it's just a figure of speech, you know? Um, but if you want to do it literally, shit. <laughs> No. Mm -hmm. I don't want a rolling pin. I don't want a tall glass of rolling pin. I just want to go find Brad. So you two are going to stay in front of me the whole time. What? Oh, he just wants to look at her booties. Oh, weirdo. Yeah, he's a little, bu he's a little butt boy. N no, I'm not a booty boy. boy. Look, look, shut up. I don't want to hear a word out of either of you. Show me Brad. Oh, okay. <sighs> All right, show you something else. Here's Brad. Huh. Body decomposing acid. What do you need that for? Uh, well, you see, uh, I was shaving in the bathtub, <laughs> and my hair got caught in the drain, and the people at Home Depot said uh, to use body decomposing acid to get the hair out of the drain, Something like because that. it can decompose bodies, and there's hair on bodies, and the hair from my body is, is what clogged the drain. Yeah, yeah, that thick mustache hair. Yeah, 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 so that, that's what I was going to use like that. that for. Really? Because there's a body right there next to the body decomposing acid. Nah. That's not a body, that's Brad. Yeah, that's just Brad. Yeah, yeah, he's sleeping. Yeah, doing Brad stuff. Yeah, he looks like he's sleeping with his eyes open and a shrimp in his mouth. What, you never been in a food coma, sir? Yeah, food, a food coma? Well, no, actually I haven't because my wife doesn't cook good enough for that to happen. Oh, uh, well. It's like uh, bro. He did it! No, he did it! <laughs> Yeah, straight to point. Hey, 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 hey. You both had something to do with this, so you're both going to jail. Oh, going to jail? I ain't going to jail, bro. You will have to catch me. And even if I do get caught, I'm snitching. Your Honor, he did it. The defender right there, he did it, Your Honor. Facts. That's what happens. What, uh, hold on. He's not dead. Well, he's, not, he's not? No, he's a very light pulse. Well, you can still save him? Yeah, let me just uh, get my doctor outfit on, drag him upstairs and do CPR. Well, no, do, do it right here. Nah, 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 nah. It's, it's gotta be upstairs. No, 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 do it right here. 
I'm bring up the data right here. All right. All right, Doc, we have him on the couch. All right, I got my outfit on. I'm ready to do some CPR. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Ew, there's a shrimp in the way. I don't like shrimp. All right, let's get that out of there. <laughs> He's breathing! Uh, oh, hey, oh, I have a really bad shellfish allergy. What, you have a shellfish allergy? I thought you were a pescatarian. Well, yeah, but not that pesky. What? Oh, wow, I guess you guys aren't going to jail after all. What? I'm going to jail! I'm free! Hey, Marvin, is Brad okay? Yeah, I'm okay, babe. He has a shellfish allergy. Wow. Well, hey, since there's a doctor here, hey, Doc, you think you could take this surfboard off my hand? It's, like, stuck there and it's ruining my life. Please, dear God, help me. All right, you folks have a nice night. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why nobody was trying to get the surfboard off him, bro. What's up with that, Mark? But that's it, though. That's that's, that's in my movie. Unfortunately, Jeffy didn't drown. Um... I don't know what was up with Chef Pee Pee and, and, and Mario, excuse me, Marvin, smooching, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully they expand upon that in future episodes because I'm with it. Y'all y'all know how I get down over here, but, you know, I don't know why they they, they pump fake it, bro. They go wait for the kiss. Uh, no. Nah. Wait for that. Nah. But yeah, though, bro. Like, I don't want and also too, I don't understand how Rose got so many, so many, so many exes. Like Kevin Samuel says, you a five at best, sweetie. Like, I don't get it. I don't get it. But that's it, though. Hopefully, guys enjoyed it. If you do, you already know what to do. Your favorite... Your favorite Cambodian... <laughs> your favorite Cambodian YouTuber, okay?